Hey guys, today I'm showing you my recreation of a Siri hairstyle from The Witcher Season 2. It mainly involves creating waves in my hair and then doing a waterfall crown braid. So I'm gonna start the night before and put my hair in four Dutch braids while it's still slightly damp from my shower. This will create the wave pattern that I'm going for. Now it's the next morning and I'm taking out my braids. I try to be gentle to not create too much frizz, but honestly, this is kind of a messy hairstyle so a bit of frizz won't hurt. As you can see, I've got a full head of waves right now and it looks pretty similar to the wave that Siri wears. Next, we're gonna do our waterfall braid. So grab a very tiny section at the front of our head and split it into three sections. Then cross the top section over the middle and then the lower section over the middle to create one stitch. Now the waterfall braid starts. Grab a tiny bit of hair to add to your top section, then cross it over to the middle. Now we're gonna drop our lower section, and I like to keep it in place by just putting it in my mouth, but you can also just put it over your shoulder. Then you grab a new section of hair to replace your lower section, and place that over the middle. Now we're back at the start. So add a tiny bit of hair to your top section, cross it over the middle, drop your lower section, grab a new lower section, and cross that over the middle. And repeat these steps until you get to the back of your head. Now, in the series, someone has braided that hair, which is honestly probably a wig, but maybe not, um, with very, very tiny sections. And when you do this on someone else, that might be doable, but I found when doing this on myself, these are about the tiniest sections that I can take. Now when I get to the end of my first half braid, I'm just gonna braid it to keep it in place, but we'll undo that braid later on. Now let's do the same on the other side. Grab a tiny piece of hair in the front of our face, split it in three sections. Top section over the middle, lower section over the middle. Now add a piece of hair to our top section and once again over the middle, and then drop our lower section, and grab a new lower section, and pass that over the middle. And just keep doing that until we reach, once again, the back of our head. Now once we've reached the back of our head, we can grab our other braid and just tie them both off with one elastic. Afterwards, I'll undo the braid that I did to keep my first braid in place, and we're basically done. All that's left to do is to tug a bit on our braids to cover up any spots that we don't like, and maybe loosen it a bit to give it a bit more definition. But in general, after just playing around with it for a bit, I'm done. And there we go, this hairstyle is done. Like I said, this is my attempt at doing series hairstyle from The Witcher. If you'd like me to try and recreate any other hairstyles from The Witcher, let me know and I'll definitely give it a try. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next time. Bye.